Which reminds me, you may have noticed that I am wearing a pizzeria hat and shirt. This is because I have a day job. It's, it, it's, it's true. Not, no reason to lie about it. I don't make a living at this. So take that for what it is also. Oh, yeah. My boss is going to be really happy that I wore this for this, this little mini self-interview thing that I got going on here. But, <clears throat> but no, pretty much any time you say pizzeria anywhere in, uh, in a context that's going to be heard by a whole bunch of people, Brian Dickman is very, very happy with you. <laughs> so, um, yes, uh, the next, next song I want to play is, is also another new song. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of go through these a lot. Uh, this is this is not a serious song. Uh, it's about my cat, and I wrote it a couple days ago. Yeah, my cat is the devil. Devil cat blues. <laughs> cat is the devil and he won't go away he's got a blind eye and something to say better run when you see him or you're sure to pay cause my cat is the devil and he won't go away his hand sounds like a roar My cat is the devil, and he'll eat your soul. If your name is Robin, then he'll swallow you whole. When he should be full, he's coming for more. When you see him coming, just close the door. Well, his tongue's forked as his ears. And he lived ten thousand years. Well, your kid Elm's best be aware when the devil cat is there. Allergic to cats, it's just an excuse. His breath smells like rats And his tail's a noose Hissing and biting Just something to do Cause Oscar the devil He's coming for you Well, he'll catch you in your sleep And he'll sadden if so he'll reap This is what we get. Yeah. Devil cat blues. <coughs> Excuse me, I have a cat allergy. Uh, oh, what should I play next? So this is this is fun. Uh, I'm probably gonna run out of memory on my camera pretty soon. Only have two gigabytes. What can I do with two gigabytes? Twenty-four minutes, actually. So, yeah, I'm going to get cut off mid-song, and it's, it's going to be fun, and I'm probably going to post that. So, you should probably, you know, <laughs> uh, actually.
actually listen to them in sequence if you want to get the joke at the end. Um, what hasn't been up? Let's see. Macaron's up. Dogen is up. Another round. I could do another round. All right. <laughs> Uh, I've got this song out on the internet. Uh, it's on Django Internet Radio. I tried to get it onto Pandora, but I, I uh, there was a problem with the CD cover images. Oh, I should tell you all that we have we do have an album available on on iTunes and Napster and eMusic and all that kind of kinds of things. Amazon MP3. Yeah, those are just the big ones, but. But uh, yeah, you pretty much Google liverwurst lads and, and you're going to get us. If you actually enjoy anything that you hear, um, please do do download it. Uh, I have obviously no problem with people listening to my music for free. Uh, just because I'm, I'm doing this, you know, up on, on YouTube, all that jazz. Um, but. Oh, also, um, again, one of the questions that I get asked a lot is. How do you feel about piracy, uh, specifically people downloading music for free on the internet? And my answer is I love it. And I think that uh, most professional musicians actually love it also. Um, because it's a great way that, that people can get their music. And, and if people have an attitude like mine, honestly, my attitude is... I personally, as a musician, would rather have every single person in the world. Are you listening to me? I would rather have every single person in the world download my music and listen to it for free than have even one person pay for it and not listen to it. Seriously. Okay, so 